Hey guys, welcome back to another vlog. Today we're starting the vlog late in the week. We're starting it on a Wednesday. Yeah. So right now we are at Lakeside because we are going to go look at what are we looking at? Wedding rings. Wedding rings. So I kind of have an idea of what I'm looking for. You kind of really don't, do you? No, I've got a kind of idea, but I'm still open-minded. Yeah, so we kind of just want to try some rings on today, see what we like and stuff. I got to get some makeup stuff because I forgot some of my makeup at my house, especially my powder. So if I look extremely oily or have looked extremely oily this last week, that is why. Because I don't have my powder. I'm an oily person. I can't help it, okay? It's just like, I just spew oil from we my face. We don't even need to buy some. We just use it to cook. Yeah, exactly. You just We just get oil from my face, huh? Just like fry up some eggs in the morning and stuff. Yeah, so we're going to do that. I'm also going to stop by entertainers to try to look for some slime kits. Hopefully, we find something and I don't come out empty-handed because I'll probably throw a temper tantrum. <laughs> Alrighty, so we are, we've just looked at some rings, um, we'll kind of talk about it later, but we are going to try this new place, what was it called? Wasabi's. Wasabi, sushi, and bento, so I'm going to eat healthy, hold on, let me show you guys. So, I've got this, Ricky has never had like sushi sushi, so he's going to have this, and then he also got some, katsu. some chicken katsu curry, so. Hopefully it tastes good because it's the first time we're having it. Alrighty, so we are done at Lakeside and as always I got myself a coffee. I got Ricky a double chocolate chip as well. So you know we got to we sat down for a while, had some coffee, we looked at some rings. I actually found one I really like. So did Ricky, but we kind of want to look online, see if we could find any other rings that you know are similar or that we might like even better. So we hope to make the final decision by next week we'll on Yes, we have to do it soon because I have extremely skinny fingers, like, e. like yeah, it's, it's size E, if that means anything to you, uh, but they're so small, I think the store, the smallest they made in the one of the rings that I wanted was like, what, like an eye or something? Uh, yeah. Yeah, and I so. No matter what store we go to, they're gonna have to order your size. Yeah, so because they have to order it, and because they kind of have to custom make it, um, it's gonna take a long time, and we don't have that long because we are getting married at the end of July. So, um, I, I think I think we'll be able to get it done. Hopefully, fingers crossed. Ricky kind of found a ring that he likes as well, so we're excited about that. And then I found nothing else that I wanted. I really like this Open Glory face wash, and they didn't have it. And they have it in America, but I waited to get it in England because it was supposed to be cheaper and they didn't have it and I was heartbroken. And then Primark didn't have my foundation or my face powder, so I'm just going to be an oily mess until I could find another Primark to go to. My face actually does look oily. I just say it's highlighter, you know? It's just natural highlighter. I'm just, just beaming. It's just a camera. <laughs> Faces. Yeah, on TV they powder you so much because they have to because of all the lights and stuff. But now we're heading back. Um, it is a stream day, so I might probably take a nap because I'm an old lady and whenever I go out for more than an hour, I just take a nap to rejuvenate myself. But I'll show you some of the things that I got when we get back. Hey girls and guys, it is a Saturday today and uh, we didn't do uh, much vlogging this week, did we? <laughs> I think I said I was gonna show you guys what we got and then I never actually did show you, but if I remember, I'll show you guys at the end. But today is Saturday and Ricky and I are gonna try to do our first like real barbecue. <laughs> I'm really scared because this could end up really bad. Really, really bad. I'm gonna turn the camera around so they can see what you're doing. Um, so we're gonna do some steaks, some sausages, and some chicken as well. Are we gonna do the chicken? Might as well. Yeah, maybe. I don't, I don't know why we're doing this much food when it's just the two of us, but go big or go home. So, let's see how it goes. Alright, so we actually got the fire going. Look at these. Look. look. It's moved over to that side. I mean, kind of, right? I mean, it started to turn grey. That's good. Oh. <laughs> the wind's gonna put it out. I hope not. Okay, all we need is for the charcoal to turn grey and then we'll be good. And then you'll be perfect. It's coming out good, isn't it? Yeah. Yes. Look. Ah. Turn it. <laughs> oh yes, you got some of the sausages here, the corn, onions. They're gonna be nice with the hot dogs. I'm happy. Yay! All right. 
So it is finished and it was a success. Ricky and I are whole. We didn't burn ourselves, no accidents, no blisters. So it's the moment of truth. Hold on, let me show you. So here it is. We got corn with grilled onions, which are really nice, like little green onions. Cucumber, we got uh, grilled chicken. We got some steaks, very nice. We got some hot dogs with onions on top. I think it came out good, don't you? Yeah, for the first day, I mean, the first time ever. This is a lot of food for Ricky and I, but I'm sure we'll eat it because, <laughs> well, you know what I like about this stuff? What? I feel like if we don't finish anything, we could, have, we could have it tomorrow. Yeah. Like the chicken and stuff, it looks really good. I can't wait to try it. Mmm, it's got be, it smells really nice though. So, I'm looking forward to it. <laughs> hey everyone, today is Sunday, the day after our wonderful barbecue. And usually, the day where we upload the vlog, so there's usually no footage for Sunday. So if you if you happen to watch this on Sunday, if it goes up on Sunday, then you're watching like, like it's like more live footage, isn't it? That means everything we're about to do didn't well, work. It oh yeah, it worked. If you see this vlog today, people, it means it worked. So basically, last night it was the craziest thunderstorm I've ever experienced maybe not Ricky because like obviously he's lived in England for a long time but um, we get thunderstorms in California once in a while but they're usually like very short and they're not very bad literally I felt like there was an earthquake in that house that's how bad this thunder was, was last so night loud. it was so so loud so at one point Ricky fell asleep I was still awake because I was kind of feeling a little bit nervous about the thunderstorm and the dogs are really nervous so I was a bit restless so finally, you know, he's sleeping, I'm about to fall asleep, and then all of a sudden, boom, another thunder. And it was so loud, it woke Ricky up, um, and right after that, the internet went out, just like if immediately. The, if, you, if you didn't know there was a thunderstorm, you would have wondered what that bang was. It yes. Was loud as bang. Yeah, it was so loud. So the internet went out, went out right away, immediately. And we're thinking, okay, in the morning it'll be fine, it was just the thunder. Well, we woke up this morning, and there's still no internet, and Monday is bank holiday or if you're in America it's like Memorial Day it's just another holiday over here it's just you know nobody works and stuff so he called up the internet provider they're like oh we won't be able to come out till Wednesday Wednesday as a youtuber that's the worst season in the world that's Sunday Monday Tuesday Wednesday without videos that is way too long so we think it's the moto and this because yeah, the moto is making a weird noise now yeah it's making this really like high pitch like, sound lightning like struck the house and I don't know what happened, but it's happened before my house like it was just a power outage and then afterwards the modem just never worked I called my internet provider and then after hours of trying to talk to somebody one guy finally knew what he was talking about And he told me it was my modem that broke it basically like when the power goes out and it comes back on Sometimes it could be too much power to something and it just messes up the insides of your but electronics Trying to tell the internet provider that your modem's broken. They it's impossible. They don't want to listen. No, I, I hate that about companies and like I, and I'm sitting there like um, it's making a weird noise that it never made before they're like okay we'll okay, get someone else to fine. look at it yeah but they can't get someone to look at it till wednesday and that's way way too long if it was just a couple days it wouldn't have been a problem but wednesday you're pushing it a little too far and there's no guarantee that they'll fix it on wednesday so it could be longer than that and i'm like okay so we're running to the store right now we're gonna try to buy a modem try to replace it ourselves and see if that fixes it if it doesn't then it seems like we're just gonna have to wait till wednesday and that means you guys will not see this vlog. <laughs> yeah, you won't see. If you see this today, Sunday, that means everything went to Yes. Plan. So we haven't had breakfast. We literally got up, got ready. You're going to the store right now, hoping well, I, to get this photo. I was on the phone before you even Yeah, up. so fingers crossed that everything works out. All right, so we're back in the car, but it's actually way later in the day. Because guess what? What's the last clip? Huh? What's the last clip we did? Well, we're talking about the internet oh, yeah. and guess what we actually got a fix yeah, which is yeah. finally and it was the modem like we thought we kept insisting they didn't listen so we went out got it by the way if you're wondering my hands orange it was pollen from a flower but yes um so we got that fix which means videos are still back on track and all that good stuff but today we did say in the live stream on saturday that we were going to do like a little q a because we didn't do much for this vlog mostly because a lot of it was just like wedding stuff like looking at wedding rings and all of that unsuccessful wedding stuff oh, yeah uh, we unsuccessful went, we went yes, to go very... look at wedding rings and we didn't get any so it's not even like we went to go get wedding rings and we could show you them or nothing no so we, we obviously are going to like there wasn't much to show so i told you guys to tweet me some questions ricky and i so here we go the first one is from school nicola and she said 
what made you guys do a YouTube channel? Have you ever answered that? Uh, yeah, I think I have. Well, for me, I think YouTube was like this fun outlet. It looked like so. I remember because you have to think. I've been watching YouTube since like 2009. Like I've been watching it for such a long time, and it always looked like so much fun. And um, it was just like an outlet for me. I have a lot of energy, and it was like an outlet, you know. Yeah. What about you? For me, I never used to really watch YouTube that much. Mm -hmm. I used to, I only used to go on YouTube to watch football videos. Yeah. And I, and I made a few football compilation videos of like goals <laughs> and stuff like way back in the day. But Can that, you show us one one day? Yeah, well, if I can find it, I will. Uh -huh. That's way back in the day, I made some of those. And then one day my cousin, Dinkies or Dean, Messaged me and me messaged me about this game Minecraft. Yeah. Says, go check it out. And so obviously, when you go check something out, you obviously go to YouTube to to go search to, it. Go yeah. Search it. And I started watching videos on it, and I thought the game looked a bit weird. And then, I, <laughs> and then I started um, watching some other gameplay videos. I think it was Call of Duty because at the time I liked Call of Duty. Uh huh. And then I just start. And then from then I just started watching YouTubers play Call of Duty. And then I um. And, and then I, I, I got, got into, into YouTubers then and I made a friend, Professor Chaos. He had a YouTube channel and he convinced me to start my channel. And, and then I thought, oh, alright. So it was like kind of like friends and like that kind of... Friends and family, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, um, so the next question, I'm just going to go, I'm just going to scroll through. So the next question was from Mario and he said, what's your favorite singer and song? I don't really have a favorite singer and song. It's a lot. I don't, I don't have a... I go through phases. Like right, what would you say right now? The weekend? I, I, no, I would say the weekend was like, like a year last ago. year. Yeah, last year. But year. right now, I, I don't think I have anyone. But I go through phases. Like one, or like like as I said, one uh, I'll be obsessed with the weekend and his album. And then before that is probably like Sam Smith. And then, oh yeah, I would say Sam Smith is definitely up there for me. Oh my gosh, the battery's gonna die. Okay, so I go through phases. phases yeah, we go through phases. So it's not really like one select person mm -hmm. all right so next let's see it's because they they're mixed in with a lot of other tweets that's why i'm scrolling through <laughs> all right so let's see another question was from chloe and she asked how did we meet well, i feel like we should do a dedicated video to that yeah. so chloe we'll get back to you on that question um oh, keisha <laughs> xx keisha xx says what do you use to make your thumbnails and what do you use to edit just adobe stuff huh yeah adobe, but it's not it's not free it's, no it's, it's really expensive it's quite expensive really get, expensive but if you want to do like there's there is free softwares out there you can get but it's just i know it's hard to i don't use any of the free ones because i don't use any of the free ones so we'd use adobe photoshop and adobe premiere yes all right so we're gonna order some food but i'll get back to you guys Alright, so I am back now and we got our food, which is so exciting. So I bookmarked a lot of the tweets so it would be a lot easier. So the next question is from Pro L and she asked, What names do you have in mind for your future children? I never thought about that, but I'm so nervous about that. Yeah, you know what? I always think of like names always pop in my head but I always forget them. Same. I and always hear a name. I'm gonna like start writing them down. Yeah. Just for the future. Because I don't want our kids to be stuck with some not nice name. Keisha. <laughs> yes, Keisha for sure. Alright, the next one is from K pop Wonder is it wonderful? K pop Wonderland. And uh, they asked, who is most likely to be late? You or Ricky? Me. Batman right there. For sure. Uh Lacey said were you born in America or Mexico and do you like to say that you're Mexican? I'm assuming that question's for me. Um, I was born in Mexico. No, I wasn't. I was <laughs> no. born in England. Yeah, Ricky's Jamaican and uh, British. He was born in England. I was born in America. And I don't have a problem saying I'm Mexican. I, I, like, I never like feel the need to be like, I'm Mexican, but I'm not ashamed of it or anything. I don't mind. I'm proud of it, you know? I love my culture. Uh, MT Salvi? So Marina says, did you ever feel like stopping YouTube? And if so, why? Is there a point you ever felt like quitting, basically? The thing is, think, uh, I think, I don't think I've ever wanted to quit, but I felt like there was a time where I might have to for my future. It's hard to say because I'm not much of a quitter in general. Like, uh -huh. I would so just, you wouldn't have liked it. I will hold on to things as long as I can. Yeah. But I would say there's been moments where like... It just gets a lot. It's, it's very just, stressful. It's like life. It's like anything. You can't tell me you've never been to school and you feel like, oh, I want to leave school. Yeah, like, yeah. It's like life. And it, it's, it, it's, it's just hard. It's a little bit of a situation where you don't know how stressful YouTube is until you do it yourself. I think you have to end up asking. I think there's always a point where you ask your question. 
you ask yourself Should I continue a question, this? is this the right thing to do? Yes, and I think definitely. Every, everybody always has that moment. You always have that little doubt sometimes. So the next one is from Bestie Short and Tall. My question for the Q&A is, what is your typical clothing for the day? And do you know the weight? <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, I like it to just be in like a nice t-shirt, like usually like a slouchy t-shirt, so it looks a little bit fashionable and jeans. Yeah, yeah same t-shirt jeans, huh? T-shirt, t-shirt And a snapback. Jeans, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh-huh. And I usually wear flats. Um, Brianna says, what's your favorite Mexican food? Mine is enchiladas. I love enchiladas. I would say my favorite Mexican food is pozole or enfrijoladas. Mine? I can't even think right now. Tacos? I don't know. What would you say mine is? Um, I don't know. Tacos? We'll just go with tacos for you. (laughs) Alright, so that is my diet anytime. So I'm trying to answer as many as possible. Um, Vivian Rodriguez says, Hi, for your Q&A, I want to know, where are you and Ricky going to live? In California or England and why? Alright, so this is another question that we're going to wait to answer till after we're married. Right? Yeah, we know the answer though. Yes. We're going to surprise you guys. We know, but you don't know. Not yet. Alright, and then uh, Emily Paul says, are you guys really getting married? Yes, yes we actually are actually Very getting married. Soon. Alex, aka Alec, says, Are you guys planning to move in together and get a house? And who is better, me or Pro L? Definitely Pro L. Just kidding. <laughs> yes. Yes, we definitely are planning to move in together, get a house together. Um, but obviously that's gonna happen after the we're married. Will be lit when we do that. Oh my gosh, the vlogs are gonna be real late after that. And who's your favorite, Pro L or Alec? I like them both equally. You guys are like our children. We can't pick a favorite. That's I just... can. Oh, you. <laughs> okay, no. Um, we can't pick a favorite. We love you guys both equally. You know, you guys are both our favorite children. We love all of you guys. You guys are all our favorites. All right. So the last question I had was from uh, Annalie Galicia, and she said, "What made you do YouTube in the first place?" I think we answered that, didn't we? Yes. Yeah. So and then she said, "Which Roblox YouTuber do you like?" I like Binks. Do you like that Lesbian? No. Oh, wow. No, yeah, you. You better say me. So it is now about 11 p.m. We just finished streaming. Just got my video up. We're here. I'm just gonna start editing the vlog soon. So I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here. Hopefully next week is a bit more exciting. Like we said, it's just a lot going on that was like not that interesting. Well, it was interesting for us because we were late for our wedding rings, but not for you guys because we didn't pick one. But hopefully next week we can sort that out. Um, it depends on the weather because we got some things planned. But if it's raining, we won't be able to do them, but we'll see. But anyway, you guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe and all that good stuff. And we will see you guys in the next vlog. Bye!